Understanding hurry and soon in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a commonly used phrase in advertising and marketing. Hurry and soon. This phrase is a great example of how English can be used to create a sense of urgency and encourage action. So, let's dive in and understand what it really means. The phrase, hurry, and soon, is a combination of two parts. First, let's look at, hurry. This is an imperative verb, which is used to give commands or instructions. It means to do something quickly or to move fast. Now, let's explore, and soon. This part of the phrase talks about the conclusion of something in a short period of time. Ends, is the third person singular present tense form of the verb, end, which means to finish or come to a close. Soon, is an adverb suggesting that the ending is imminent or will happen in the near future. In marketing, hurry, and soon, is often used to create a sense of urgency. It suggests that there is a limited time offer or opportunity that won't last long. This phrase is typically seen in sales promotions, special deals, or limited time offers. The goal here is to motivate the audience to act quickly, usually to buy a product or service before the offer expires. Let's look at some examples where you might encounter this phrase. 1. Retail stores, hurry, and soon, 50% off all items this weekend only. 2. Online services, subscribe now, hurry, this special offer ends soon. 3. Events and tickets, get your tickets now, hurry, sale ends soon. In these examples, the phrase is being used to encourage immediate action or decision making. You might also come across variations of this phrase, such as, act now, offer ends soon, or limited time, hurry before it's gone. While the wording changes, the underlying message of urgency and a nearing deadline remains the same. I hope this video helps you understand the meaning and use of hurry and soon in English, especially in the context of marketing and sales. It's a great example of how language can be used to influence behavior and decisions. Keep practicing, and you'll soon find it easier to understand such phrases in everyday life. Until next time, keep learning and stay curious.